I think he's been fantastic. He came into the group along with Ryan Jennings at the beginning of the season and, and came away pre-season and showed his quality. What were you like before the game? Your your whole family, big Wigan Athletic fans. Yeah, it was a. Uh, I was excited, but very nervous to come on really. So um, walking out of the DW, never done that before, so that was big for me. And the moment nearly did come when you you dribbled through three or four players and almost got that that goal that you wanted. Yeah, almost. Uh, that would have been a dream come true. That, but unfortunately not. But hopefully, if I get another chance, I'll stick it in. On the ball, his quality is undoubted. He's a, a fantastic uh, technical football player uh, and he worked extremely hard on his fitness to, to get in the team and, and gave us some great moments. His goal against Fleetwood probably been the highlight. Jacobs now running towards the edge of the penalty area. Jacobs into the area now, looks to set it across. Ryan recovers, but he's still alive as he crosses. Jacobs comes out towards Flores, left foot shot. Jordan Flores into the top left hand corner of Chris Maxwell's goal on his first league start for Wigan Athletic. Oh, it's an unbelievable feeling, really. It's what I've dreamed of as a kid. So it's good to get it and good to get the win as well. He obviously had some difficult times throughout the season, but as a young player, you're, you're always going to get that and he has to learn from that. Next year, he has to work on his fitness. It's a massive part of football now, especially in midfield, and he has to come back stronger because, as I said, his, his technical uh, element of his game is, is not in question. So he has to work hard and, and make sure he, he hits the ground running next season.